Yo soy Guillermo Rigondeado y estamos viendo Boxing News Today. Yo soy Guillermo Rigondeado y estoy viendo Boxing News Today. Thank you. Thank you, Guillermo. Yes. Where have you been? ¿Dónde has estado? Where the hell you been? Nunca me fui, siempre he estado a lo que siempre yo I've never left. me mantengo I've been here. por bajo perfil. Okay. But I've just been, you know? Can we start from the last time I saw you? What happened against Lomachenko? Pasó, and then we'll move forward. El, el que te, que te Broke my heart. It's what I did. It's on my behalf and I took a loss. He was the better man that night. Mm -hmm. Was it the size? Era was it the size? Como te dije anteriormente, yo, yo, el buen ganador tiene que ser un buen perdedor. Me tocó perder y me perdí. The better fighter always comes out victorious, okay. and I wasn't the better fighter. It was just pure class. Okay. It was better that night. Now, are you back at 122 or 122? 122? 122? 122? 122. So, are you going after, well, 120, 120, so we've always wanted to see you against Leo Santa Cruz. I think you and Gary Russell was a hell of a fight. Those are guys that aren't completely out of my range in a sense of size. Uh -huh. I'm definitely up to any competition against any champion. Okay. You guys have seen it before. What was the plan when you signed with Al Heyman? What was the plan? que me ha abierto la puerta y ahora es que empieza y hemos redondeado que la gente piensa que ya se acabó no se acabó no a ver cuándo es I want to thank Al Heyman because he's put me in the best position ever. He's opened up all the doors that no one's ever done for me in my career. Right now is when you're going to see the real rigging down. So, so after this fight, this is pretty much a tune-up fight, per se. Yeah. Uh, who are you calling out at the end of this fight? Who wants to call after the fight? The one who wants, and there I have my weight in the 122 libras. He goes, any champion at 122, if Vargas has a belt, whoever Ray Vargas? Ray Vargas? You know, whoever has a belt, 122, we now, does it upset you? When I watch you, I enjoy you. Pure boxer, perfect boxer, great counter punches, slip punches, all that good stuff. Does it bother you that fans don't, don't uh, respect your genius in the ring? No, no me interesa que la gente hable. La gente siempre van a hablar, siempre tienen crítica. Pero al final del día tienen que decir que yo soy un excelente boxeador. Le guste o no le guste, tienen que aceptarlo. People are always going to criticize you at the, at the end of the day, but they're always giving you credit for being the champion. So from all his accolades, they got to give him respect. They can criticize him a lot, but all the respect should be at him. Do you know oh, Luis Ortiz? Do y'all know each other personally? Do you think he beats Anthony Joshua? El contra Joshua. ¿Qué tú crees? Va a ser buen combate. Como siempre. Yo le voy a mi cubano. Como se lo digo. I go with the family. Come on. Go human. Okay. I think Ortiz can do it. Okay. You've gone up in weight to face Lomachenko. What's your impression of Mikey Garcia versus Earl Spence? De Mikey Garcia haciendo lo mismo. Con Spence. Mikey Garcia tiene tremenda experiencia y tiene cuerpo también. No es muy grande, pero tiene cuerpo. Excellent experience. Y creo que, lo, y creo que lo va a hacer bien. Lo va a hacer a 100%. I think he's going to make it an excellent, excellent fight and it's going to be really competitive. It's going to be really competitive. Really competitive. Really competitive. En la pelea va a ser buena. Va a ser buen competitivo. Yeah, very competitive. He says it's going to be really head to head, not like people think. Okay. What are your thoughts on Lomachenko versus Mikey Garcia? ¿Qué te ve 125 Garcia contra Lomachenko? No, el Lomachenko todavía no quiere pelear. Whenever Lomachenko does decide to fight Mikey, it's going to be a hell of a fight. It's going to be real competitive. It can go either way. How good is Lomachenko? Like, have yeah, well, you been in the ring with him? What does he do that makes him great? What does Lomachenko do that makes him great? He has good speed, good reflexes, good laterals, and good lateral movement that normal boxers have never seen. It's once in a lifetime talent. Once in a lifetime talent of explosion, speed, velocity, and lateral movement.
Same size you win though, right? Mismo tamaño, Lomachenko, Rigondeau, tú le ganas. Mismo tamaño, 122. Dile que haga 122. Tell him to come down the 122. Tell him to come down the 122. Oye, y pregúntale al 126. Ask him the 126. He said no. Lo voy a noquear. He said 130. Lo voy a noquear. He said all right. Go ahead. Come down 126. I'm down 122. Give me a shot. You didn't even have to cut weight for that fight. You just. Tú no tenías que perder peso por eso, ¿verdad? Por esa pelea. No tenías que perder peso por esa pelea. Te montaste peso. He goes, yeah, I, I gained actually too much weight. I, I no pasó nada. En realidad no pasó nada porque no se vio nada ni pudo hacer nada. Tampoco. Nothing really happened. We couldn't see something that was really explosive that fight, and it's sort of sad to say, but we're both excellent fighters, probably once in a generation fighters, and the explosion and the athleticism sucks that it got cut short, but you know, great match. How about Tank Davis, Abner Mares? Uh, el, el Mayweather, Gervonta Davis contra Abner Mares, ¿qué tú crees? Bien parejito, todo también pareja. They're both really head to head, really competitive. Muy really, buena pelea. Look at it, it's going to be a really good fight. Did he fight Abner Mares in the amateur? Tú has fajado Abner Mares en lo amateo. Yes, yes, sir, in the Pan American about, Games. If you could tell us about the. ¿Y cómo te fue esa pelea? What do you think? <laughs> he, he won. Do bueno. Do bueno. Abner Mares bueno. <laughs> no, he beat you. He beat you? Abner Mares beat you? No. I just want to get a reaction out of it. That's all. <laughs> but he's an excellent fighter. We'll give him that. Just bringing down Phil, do you feel refreshed now being with Al Heyman? There's always light at the end of the tunnel. You know, thank you, Al Heyman. It's the start of 2019. It couldn't have been any better. Thank you, Al Heyman. And why did he take such a long layoff? He just, he just needed that for the fight. There was a few contractual issues that he had to let go before, you know, really making the decision. Better, better late than never. I'm back. <laughs> now, people have always said like, oh, he's too old, he's too young. How old are you for real? Yo, más de 24 menos 28. Nah, 20 what? 20 what? How old are you? 38? 38? Yeah, but none of those kids can beat me any day in the ring. <laughs> none of those kids are the talent. Ray Vargas actually has a fight next month, right? Ray Vargas has a fight. Yeah, that belt's not going to be his anymore. You'll see me in the ring soon. So, so the plan is to get this fight and then get potentially get Ray Vargas? The plan is to get Ray Vargas. Any champion 122, Vargas is one of them. He's on the list. Whoever the WBA champion is, do you guys know the BA or the BO 122 is? So we can name them right now because we want them in the ring. His plan for 2019 is to clear up the division. We want to take everyone out, get all the belts back, because he more than simply can. And then from there, evaluate you know, which fighter now stable really wants to come and compete against them. This is the thing he really likes about PBC, he was talking about in the fighter interviews earlier, is that the best fight the best. So whether he wants it, whether they want it, they're going to end up coming colliding. So hopefully there's some momentum and something's going to be big for one of those big names. What were his thoughts when he moved up to fight Lomachenko? Pensaba cuando te, que cuando tú moviste a 130, te quitaron la faja de 122. Ah, no tenía que haberlo hecho, pero tú sabes cómo es esto, las sucesiones son así. You know, it's part of the boxing business. You can't really get upset about it. Um, something a little unjust. He feels like he was never beaten at 122, but can't do much about it. We just got to win him back again. They're ours. Perfect. Thank you. Do you have any re real serious question? Do you have any regrets about your career 
Um, up until this point. What's done is done. Let's move forward. Things can't change, so I don't regret anything. I can't wait for the future, which is going to be the best part. How, how much time do you have left? <laughs> I, I can no more, but I'll keep on. Appreciate it. Thank you, Gerber. Appreciate your brother. Thank you. Appreciate you, King. Thank you. Thank you. Also, you will get the way into the main event, so the main event please get set to here to begin with the main event. The main event is higher plus two. The main event yeah, only in the sky with higher plus plus two. You ain't cooking. I tell. I was trying to remember your Instagram name to tag you. What is it? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to West Hills. It was Pam from the right. I was looking for it this morning to tag him. I was like, what the hell? Microsoft Gator here from the Pam Gator. I was looking for it this morning to tag him. I was like, what the hell? Microsoft Gator here at LA Live. Brought to you by TG 